Hello YouTube to my uh, video tutorial and today I'm just going to show you um, some freeware files, open source files and media that you can that you can download for free with um, no viruses and it's completely legal and basically um, this video is inspired by mobile phone 2003's version of the video so I'm basically just acting up acting upon his video and adding some stuff of my own. Anyway, um go check out Mobile Phone 2003 and subscribe to him. He's a really awesome tutorial guru. Anyway, um we'll start off with legit torrents. Um basically it's just exactly what the website is. Legit torrents. Legitimate torrents, um, so torrents, you know, are downloads that are peer to peer like LimeWire, but this is basically just torrents that are not pirated and are use, not user uploaded by, but, um, uploaded by the webmasters. So, this sort of corresponds with my How to Use Daemon Tools Lite video, and it's just a very good all around, um, torrent, uh, website hosting's website I guess so you can find lids uploads and type just anything you want and try to find it so you can just media just games music anything you want and um let's go to uTorrent actually this is the world's lar largest legal torrent search engine so this is sort of like legit torrents, just larger, and this is all legal, not pirated. This used to be illegal, but they cho totally um, changed their. I I think they just totally um. How do I say this? Reorganize their website to just include legal torrents, and it has currently. 67,170 legal torrents. You can browse by all music, video, TV, movies, games, software, books, and other. You can even get books. There are probably ebooks out there. And yeah, I I personally use this website and I highly recommend it. Next is SourceForge.net. Just free um, source uh, where files basically. Now find software. You can donate, I guess, and search. So basically, most of these websites are just you search for free files and you get it, and they're all legal. Next is freewarefiles.com. I really like this website. Um, you can buy, you can get a lot of good games for free. Usually, the games are either really old or classic games. But some of them are actually new and free games like America's Army and Command and Conquer Gold. You can browse by all these different software categories like antivirus, audio and video. Um, usually that one on ones I use is probably utilities and games. And the GIMP 2.5, yeah they should have that, it's totally free. All this is freeware and this is, I think, to me, this is like the best website out of all of these. I'm going to show you. I just really like this website. It has a nice interface. Not too much ads, but just enough to bug you a little. But it's blue, my favorite color. Maybe it's with some orange, but that's okay. And yeah, I really like this website. And. Next is Kaiman.us, which is basically just for games. Yeah, you can. I downloaded a couple. Um, like they have Stratego, Chess, and stuff like that for board games. And they have. I think I downloaded Halo Zero, which is just a PC version of Halo. Or Halo. It's like before Halo One, and I and I think it's an actual game made by. Uh, Bethesda, uh, not, not Bethesda, um, gosh, Ubisoft, no, Bungie, there we go, and yeah, 
They have a lot of um, games there. Super Mario and Tetris. Oh, I like that and shoot them up. RTS, RPG. Yeah, they have a lot of categories here. And no shareware. Well, some, not all shareware is free. But that's what it means by that. No adware, no spyware, no demos, no shareware, no trials. Only freeware. So completely free. So this is probably for your games but these are like mini games and small games if you want huge games like actual one gigabyte uh... five hundred megabyte games then i recommend freewarefiles.com artistserver.com uh... mobile phone went a little into this but i could and this is basically just for some free music you know Music, music charts, ringtones. I think this is um, just some small bands out there that upload their own stuff, and you can find some good starting musicians here. I think Jamendo, basically the same thing. And you know, you can explore these websites yourself. They're all freeware, and you just have to find. Um, some freeware files that you could download and yeah yeah if you have any needs for any programs or anything then these you have to be able to find something out of these um ten or more websites freewareguide.com basically the same thing as freeware files it's a little different uh, just go here strategy and games and more and they have a huge description, file size, it's a zip file, and the download uh, link. And even a screenshot, it's a nice site. Ooh, I should, I should, I'm going to actually download some of these games right now, later. Um, next is free decent downloads. I think I've downloaded a couple games from here. Yeah, I downloaded... Uh, Let's see games. As you can see, America down America's Army is a very good free game. It's used to um, recruit new members for the army. That's why, and that's probably why it's free. And it's a very nice first-person shooter. So, and very realistic. Not like uh, it's close to Call of Duty Four um, in terms of realism and stuff like that. Um, yeah, and this one, neowin.net, is a forum, I guess, I'm guessing. Yeah, it is. And it's just basically uh, Neowin's freeware alternative list. And I love these type of things. They just, instead of, <clears throat> like, instead of Microsoft using Microsoft Office Word 2007 and paying $300, you can use OpenOffice for zero. Or instead of Adobe Photoshop, GIMP. Sorry, just, it's just something like that. And yeah, there's a huge list here. I didn't want to go through all of it. But I did. Didn't really download much because I had a, a lot of these programs still. And this is good for a lot of people. It doesn't matter. Even if you're a kid and you don't even really know how to download stuff, you could still pretty much. I mean, to download, you just click it and find the download button. And you gotta give some credit to these guys because it would have taken a long time to assemble all this Oops. and by the way on these websites don't click any of the ads you should already know that but some of them have spyware um, even if they're google advertisements but that's how they gen generate uh, fees not fees just money for their website revenue and stuff like that but Next is Freeware Home that I actually found by myself. Um, it's a very nice website, similar like Freeware Files. And yeah, I got all the categories up here on the left pane panel. And snapfiles.com slash freeware. Snapfiles version of freeware. Um, I actually, these are popular programs that are very sophisticated, like Advanced System Care Free. 
a vast home edition mega mp3 splitter i recommend this site a lot <clears throat> i actually recommend all of these sites but yeah you can browse by shareware freeware and features but i think i go into freeware shareware is not always free now is it from this video um um, check out mobile phones 2003's video his he's a really nice um, he has a really nice channel subscribe um, so that's basically it thanks for watching and I'll catch you guys later